Good morning, everybody. We're going to be making some peanut butter pancakes this morning. Titus and the kids a lot of time put peanut butter on their pancakes. So I thought, what if we just made peanut butter pancakes that already taste like peanut butter? We're going to try it. In this bowl, we're going to put one cup of pancake mix. I'm using the crusties, the kind that you just have to add water to. I'm going to put in just about a tablespoon of sugar. We're going to whisk this together and then sit it over to the side. I'm wondering if I need to double this recipe. We'll just go with this and if I need to make some more, I'll make some more real quick. I'm going to make some eggs to go with these pancakes, so this may be enough. Okay, we're going to set this to the side for a minute. I think I can mix the rest of the stuff up in here. We need a third of a cup of peanut butter. Manly's helping me this morning. Are you helping mama? One egg. This is where that one hand egg crack comes in handy. When the baby wants mama in the mornings, huh? You do it with one hand. <laughs> We need five ounces of evaporated milk. This is a 12 ounce can, so I'm gonna put in a little less than half of it. Okay, I think that's about right. And a third of a cup of water. Okay, <laughs> he finally settled for somebody else so I can stir this. All right, we're gonna mix this all together. I'm gonna go ahead and turn my griddle on over here so it can be heating up. Now, the peanut butter is not fully mixed up, but we can do that when we mix it in with the dry ingredients now. Okay, we'll mix this all together. Wow, that's smelling good. It smells like a peanut butter cake. A peanut butter pancake. <laughs> Morning jokes. I've got this at about 300. I'm gonna go with, I'm trying to decide if I wanna go with cooking spray or butter on my kind of unsalted butter already opened up, so I'm gonna use this. breakfast fresh coffee and bagels too a new day is waiting for us we got lots of fun stuff to do let's go to the zoo and feed the monkeys i can lend them your baseball cap let's make the day a bear and our fun growing up is just a trap Just a big fat trail. Okay, y'all, it's about 2.30 in the afternoon now. When we got finished with schoolwork today, I had to run to Dollar General to get some milk. I tried to put my grocery pickup order in. I started it last night, and then I finished putting it in this morning at like 5.45, almost 6 o'clock this morning. I finished putting it in. Titus gets up at like 5.15 every morning. So this morning, I went ahead and got up when he got up so I could try to get that grocery pickup order put in in time to get a time slot this afternoon. They did not have any pickups available until Friday. And I was like, what is going on? Why are there no pickups available until Friday? Because normally that early in the morning, if I get it put in, there are plenty of spots available for the afternoon. And then I remembered the snow. We're supposed to get snow, maybe. It may just be rain with snow mixed, I don't know. So that is why there are no pickups available. Everybody's getting that bread and milk. And I actually really just happened to be out of milk, so I had to have some. I knew the grocery stores were probably gonna be crazy, so I told the kids, we'll just run to Dollar General after school. So I'm gonna show y'all what I got. I got two gallons of milk. They only had the Clover Valley in. A lot of times Dollar General has Mayfield milk, but I guess they sell out of it pretty quick. Plus, you know, with snow coming. <laughs> They may have already sold out. The lady said they'd already been kind of busy today. So they had Clover Valley. I got two gallons of that. I got the kids some gloves. Audra already opened her pack. This was part of her pack back there. And then I got the older boys some and Jonah some. Uh, the boys also needed shampoo for upstairs. So I got them this suave men kind for up there. I got some pimento cheese because I walked past it and I was like, I'd really like to have a pimento cheese sandwich maybe for lunch tomorrow. Titus got some from Ingalls 
last week, I think, that was the spicy kind. Had some hot peppers in it. That was really good. But anyway, I got that. We got some of our favorite cheese dip, and I got some tortilla chips, and I got some Pirate's Booty, which the kids have already devoured. <laughs> It was a small bag and you know, they don't fill them things up. Y'all know they don't fill them up. Anyway, I saw Valentine's Day stuff while I was in there. They didn't have everything out yet because there were still a lot of empty shelves, but I did see these little things. And so I got a little, there's some of Sissy's gloves. <laughs> I got three things. I got this sign that says home is wherever you are. And I got this truck because it matched with the little checkered design on those letters. Um, this one says, let love grow. They had a red one that said, loads of love i think or something like that but i got this one because it matched with that sign and then they had several different ones of these this one says love makes a house a home i know they had one that said love never fails and a couple of other sayings on them these were only a dollar each this one and this one and then this one was 250 i think yeah 250 250 yeah, I got them all some gloves because, you know, if it's snowing tomorrow, they're going to want to go outside. I'm pretty sure Jacob and Tyler already have some really thick gloves, but I got them some just in case. And then all they had were these uh, four packs of gloves that would fit Jonah and Audra. They didn't have any single packs, but it's a pretty good deal, just $3. Normally, one pair of gloves would be a dollar, so that's a good deal. <laughs> Okay, y'all, I'm cooking supper now. I've got cornbread, muffins in the oven, ground beef and onion cooking over here. I decided to make vegetable beef soup tonight. Snow may be coming, so soup is a good thing to have on a night like that. The kids are all outside watching like it's gonna come faster. So I didn't have a big can of family-sized tomato soup, so I'm kind of making my own here. I have tomato sauce. I do have a few small cans of tomato soup. I'm gonna add these in and some diced tomatoes. I'm gonna put in that open bag of frozen lima beans that I saw in the freezer yesterday. And then I also have some canned lima beans, canned corn and carrots and all. I'm gonna put lots of, a lot of times we just put lima beans and we call it lima bean soup. But I'm gonna add in a lot of different stuff this time. Titus is snacking on tortilla chip. He didn't even know this was hidden with the canned foods. <laughs> Mr. Moss, how do you know when bad weather's coming? Snowbirds. It's actually starting to sleep just a little bit. From just a little bit. I you feel it? Little, yeah. Snowbirds. So we don't know exactly what's fixing to happen, but something's happening. Something's fixing to happen. Snowbirds. Snowbirds, buddy. Cheese dip. Let's go. <laughs> when are we gonna take them Christmas lights down? I'm going to. We might as well just leave them up. Okay, y'all. I put some salt and pepper. You got any cornbread? Yeah, you better know. I got some cornbread muffins in the oven. Uh, yeah. Buttermilk. Yep. I put salt and pepper in the oh, soup. Oh my goodness. And now I'm putting the ground beef over here. I'm just draining it a little bit as I go. All right, y'all. Put the lima beans in there. Now I'm putting the corn and I did drain it. The can of lima beans, I drained those too. I might not have room to put a lot of stuff in here. Looks like we're going to run out of room. I definitely want to put the carrots, but I think that's all I'm going to have room for. I had some potatoes, but yeah, they're not going to fit. We're just going to go with the carrots. Is it snowing yet? Uh -uh. I hear that it's sleeting a little bit, so that means y'all need to come in. Plus, supper's ready anyway. Okay.
I wanted y'all to see that. I knew he was gonna do it. He does not like cornbread. Yeah. Look, let me show you. It's yummy. Anytime I've tried to give him cornbread, he does that. Try it like that. You see how Daddy did that? Little bite. See? Mmm. See, he's yummy. <laughs> yeah. I'm waiting on his soup to cool down, so I thought I would try the cornbread again. This is good. I on knew. A cold night. I knew. I should have had him before. I'm telling y'all. I can't even talk. I can't even me. talk. Tonight, you need this right now. I knew I should There's have videoed him tasting it. There's almost a Frosty the Snowman feel out there. Jack Frost. Whatever you want to call him. Nipping at your nose. He nipping at my nose. I knew back. he was going to say, that's good on a cold night. Mm. Well, let's, when summer gets here, we all want to know what's going to be good on a hot night. Ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> Good night, old mama.